day, I'm surfing the hook. I actually used to surf this spot all the time. It's one of my favorite spots in Santa Cruz, and it's one of the places where I feel like I progress a lot in surfing, so it holds a special place in my heart. The hook, though, is a weird place to surf. It's got a mixture of longboarders, beginners, and just ridiculous pros throwing massive airs. So the lineup is this weird jumble of, like, surfers. And, of course, there's a solid local old head group out there, which I see every single time. Like the four same dudes for like four years. It doesn't matter if it's morning, noon, afternoon, sunset, they're out there. I was thinking in my head like, is this a glitch in the matrix? Like I've never seen these people surf anywhere else in Santa Cruz or I've never seen them anywhere other than the hook. And I see a lot of people like Santa Cruz is not that big. Either way, I've got a long day. I uh, got work all day today. It's Friday. So trying to finish up some crazy projects for work. And if you're new to this channel, I drop a vlog every day at 8 a.m. I'm doing a 90 day challenge where I'm doing one hour in the gym, one hour of surfing, biking or snowboarding and one cold plunge every single day. So step one for today, skipping the lunch and I'm going surfing. nine o'clock you know what makes this so different than any other workout challenge out there is when I'm done working out I get my hour in the gym I go home and I have to edit for another three plus hours to get this vlog out at 8 a.m. every single day but you know what I'm doing it we're out here Friday night the gyms are closed so there's no excuses out here getting a workout already got two miles in Got some equipment here on Westcliff, thankfully. And we're gonna grind out another one to make sure day 16 is the best day 16, the best day so far. Right by the bus, me and I got the key to unlock. I know the locksmiths, optics, speak of the loss. I'm eating lobster, chopsticks, freak of the bus, you know. I'll never fit in where I go at. Ooh. Boss talk like I'm Boaz. Ooh. Why fit in when you know you can stand out still? They remember you more when you hand out deals. Let's go.
workout's done. 50 bar dips, 100 push-ups, 100 sit-ups. Already ran two miles, running two miles back. So, getting the hour in, regardless if there's a gym. At least I have, you guys can't see, the stars and the ocean, which is amazing. But, day 16, feeling good, feeling good. And I'm ready for that cold plunge today. about 10 p.m. Just got done with that run. It's feeling good. I'm actually really psyched to get in the cold plunge. You know, the whole reason why I'm even, you know, doing this whole thing is just like to overcome challenging situations and when new challenges and stressful situations occur to be able to, you know, cruise through them like more effortlessly. And, uh, you know, 14, day 14, was a tough one to get through. Today's day 16, and today's a good day. So, you know, finding uh, those little moments to reflect upon is key in this whole process. But we're happy to cold plunge today. We're going into the weekend, which is uh, the waves are still good. Got some sunny days, or one sunny day. If you guys uh, have watched this far, thank you. Hope you guys like this video. Please subscribe. We're like so close to getting a thousand subscribers. And uh, those of you that have, thanks. I appreciate you. Uh, oh, yeah. Ooh, it's nice and cold. Oh, yeah. 